fucked up. We did one bubble lens, yeah. and I swear it was like we looked like we were in a fun house. <laughs> yeah, it was. They looked like he was that big, and I looked like the thing from like <laughs> the Fantastic Four. <laughs> well, that's better than the John Carpenter. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know. He yeah, the he thing was actually kind of cool. He impersonated some sexy guys, so who knows? That's right. Yeah, I think we're recording. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Can you can you see Devin? I'm not obscuring him. Oh, no, I should, we're good. I should, I should be on Sam's lap. I feel like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can I fit in there? Oh, yeah. You want to cash you, Devin? You guys could do like a Jeff Dunham thing. We you could. Know? Yeah. Make a billion dollars. <laughs> we could. We don't need you at all, guys. Mm -hmm. Devin can be the jalapeno on a stick. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Yeah. One of the greatest comedy creations. Mm. I went to Bucky's uh, last weekend and thought of you guys. I think I sent you a picture. Oh, really? I, 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 I sent you a photo of the bag. <laughs> you did, because yeah. I, I asked you a question about something, and you didn't respond for like three hours, yeah. and then you just sent me a picture <laughs> yeah. of a... Of a a bag of goods from Bucky's. Yeah, because you asked me yet again. So hard. Hey Sam, what's your writing process like? <laughs> where do you get your ideas from? Do you have halogen lights in the room where you write, or is it all candles? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, because if you're friends with Ben, it's the combo of like, what's your writing process, and here's a video of a retarded baby killing oh, himself. Dude. Yeah, it's like sometimes I need to open text from your brother, mm -hmm. like in a lead room. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you need to put on like those Eskimo goggles they yeah. use for the sun. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, by the way, uh, I don't want to. What is it? Give away the cart before the horse? What do they say? Put you were talking into your beer bottle instead of the mic. <laughs> yeah. You dry drunk. <laughs> I have one non-alcoholic beer and I go off the rails yeah. completely. Now, is there like 0.5 in that? I think they're the zeros, right? Right, Ben? Uh, I think these are the 0.5. Oh, right. my I've been, God. I've been look at you. Flirting oh with... Uh, oh, Jesus. Dipping your toes in the devil's mouth. The oblivion. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. And, Jace, you're but, sober, too. Yeah, I haven't drank for like a year and a half, but I wasn't crazy like Ben. I just yeah. I just drunk drove a lot, so... Oh, yeah, crazy like Ben. <laughs> there was a Budweiser tall boy in my glove box once, <laughs> and I had to talk to God and apologize. <laughs> <laughs> Not like us, right? We got it all together. No, yeah. I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. we're fine. Um, yeah. How did you, <laughs> get it together. My hands shaking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I wanted to, right up top, I wanted to, I just read your book and it's one of the best things <laughs> I've ever read. If everybody wants to, uh, right there. <laughs> Uh, yeah. And thank you for giving me the first edition. Yeah. Yeah. It's a little tattered up. It yeah. took me a while to read, but uh, I yeah. wanted to go with a different pen name. I wanted yeah. to go uh, with uh, Frank M. Dumbass, <laughs> but they wouldn't do Moss. <laughs> I saw that sitting over there, and I was like, "What is just this another problematic prop in the Ben Avery cadre?" I mean, look at this. Oh, my painting of myself as you as the, like the Hiroshima dentist who <laughs> got turned to ash that fateful day. <laughs> How are you doing yellow face in black and white, Ben? <laughs> oh, fuck. I didn't realize I made myself a Japanese guy in that. You didn't realize. I didn't. When you ordered, hey, can you paint me off Fiverr as a Japanese guy? <laughs> is this live, by the way? Uh, yeah, this is, uh, this is our producer. Uh, yeah, this is our, our producer. Our producer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's, just, he's running late. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's running late. He said, turn on channel five. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're working with the Menendez brothers. Uh, <laughs> That's a good get. They do they do a good production work oh yeah yeah uh, you know but, what you should do get them over here and take care of the neighbors <laughs> oh god these people yeah, yeah. you yeah. probably can't hear it but we have been as neighbors who they're hasidic people who do karaoke every night yeah yeah i thought I gotta, it was illegal to sing after dark it should be it should their, be in their religion yeah yeah no they're all stomping on chickpeas right now and making hummus <laughs> Baba and the Ganoushes yeah, are over there. It's like the I Love Lucy episode, except, except grapes, it's garbanzo beans. Dude, imagine squishing garbanzo beans between your toes. That'd oh, be fun. It probably feels great. Oh, that'd be yeah. Nice, dude. That's wow. probably honestly how they do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just loads of hair loaded into it. Yeah. The little like hobbit feet. Can I do a uh, can I do a plug for your book real quick up top, Sam? Oh, yeah, well, enough. I just yeah, let's be sincere nah. on the dick around and slur no. podcast. <laughs> but I want to say something nice about you. <laughs> okay, you're here a fantastic we go. writer. I Thank read you, this. Ben. I read this in the span of like a day and a half. Yeah, after lying about having read it for three years. <laughs> Nice you, you. I never, I never told I you actually, I read I it. I believe him. I yeah. really know. You kept saying it was a, it was a transcendent movement between two covers. <laughs> and I was like, wow, dude, thank you. I googled famous authors and I said, yeah, it reads like Hemingway to me. Yeah, yeah. 
secretly gay. <laughs> <laughs> Secrets out, boys. Yeah. Dump Anna, them out, Devin. And a tiny dick. <laughs> they made Did it, he have a little guy? He they had, made a documentary about him being a trans guy with a small penis. I, that was the PBS oh, yeah. one. I, I think the, Ken Burns made it. No, it was mm-hmm. Matt Walsh. It was Matt Walsh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What is a Hemingway? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What, what is a woman in the sea? <laughs> What is it, Hemingway? About two thirty. Let's have the wig on. <laughs> no, no, but he wrote a letter to Escott's. Oh, sorry, your buck. No, yeah, no, no. I was just gonna say thank you. That's very kind of you. You're you're uh, an amazing writer. Thank you. Uh, a better I'm friend. Very happy to be your your your. And Katie your, says a bestest lover. <laughs> <laughs> That's my wife for right. the listeners yeah, at home. Yeah. For yeah. the people just tuning in. It's everybody's wife. He's implying he's having sex with my wife. I didn't say that. Was that what you said? Uh, you you assume. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. Well, yeah. I, I like to draw uh, conclusions from... I like uh, to draw you. <laughs> I'd like to draw and quarter you, honestly. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, but you are uh, you're an amazing writer, and it was a, a real delight to read your book. And uh, you also... You give a tribute to Andrew Polk at the end, which of course, I love. Yeah, like the funniest guy. Mm. The guy who brought us together. That's right. Yes. Polk did bring us mm-hmm. together. You were a Polk guy, right? You know Polk? I love Andrew Polk. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. We were all friends in LA. I yeah, think yeah. he, uh, didn't he chase you out of a lighthouse with a torch once? I deserve that. <laughs> <laughs> I was being, in his words, uppity. So. Right, yeah. Well, you were begging for sanctuary. <laughs> yeah. And Jace kept saying, I'm the keeper of the lighthouse. <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Lighthouse ranch. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm the one who jerks off on the light. Okay. Yeah. So, me and only me. I smear the land. <laughs> it gives it that certain hue. Mm-hmm. When I met Ben, he was a just like a little like kind of nebbish, nervous, maybe recently sober at that point. I never drank with you. Uh, I've been sober for almost six years. Yeah, you won't shut up about it. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Uh, it's a real hey, I, didn't know, I didn't know we were reading our credits. <laughs> Until tonight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tank it. Uh, but remember we played that like uh, that board game on the TV. Oh, what's that called again? It was like, who can say the most slurs? It was effectively how That's we played it. we turned it into. Yeah. 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 Like, you played gay libs. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. It's yes. some game where you connect your phone to the TV and then... How does the game go again? I don't know, but it built trust immediately. It did, Because yeah, yeah. if, if any of that surfaced, you couldn't, you, you wouldn't, you, you would be bad. Oh, it's, it, that's, that's awful. No, yeah. I mean, mm-hmm. that, that game, I believe it's, it uh, gives you a question. Mm-hmm. And then everybody anonymously says an answer, and then your answer pops up on the screen, and you have to guess who said what you answer. Voted, which one's the funniest one? Uh, the, which one's funniest? And then, but you're also trying to guess who did it too, right? You don't know who. Well, it was pretty easy because of all the R's in the end of yeah. your words. <laughs> ben, mm. ben rubbed the N out of his phone that day. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it, I he was weathered, P9 actually. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I weathered a digital keyboard yeah, on yeah. my phone. It looked yeah. like those old like lo- like login for your security uh-huh. like system. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Numbers are lo- like rubbed off, so you know what it is. Yeah, it's like the G's on this phone don't work anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I go to the yeah. Apple Store. Yeah. yeah. Well, you're a typewriter guy, so you have to like go to like an old antique shop and be like, "Do you got any in or in or eyes, mm. dude? Yeah. You yeah. writing on a typewriter really does piss me off. Uh, yeah. I write longhand and typewriter. That's the dumbest, I'm most happy. antiquated ways to express yourself. Well, I, I told nice. you, it's a governor. Because my vehicle you, so you goes said, too fast. Hello, governor. <laughs> That's right. I'm wasting me time over here. <laughs> I like to make it hard on me. The sadism gets me off. Well, it's two parts. Uh, because yeah, I the know the boring part and the worst part. <laughs> no, I, I know it's an obnoxious thing, but it gets me. Everybody now they're on a device, they're on a screen. <laughs> Jesus Christ! God damn like, it! Especially kids these days. I mean, you know, uh, they're they're digitally yeah, native. You yeah. know. Welcome back to Club Random with Bill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, usually he's on Club Penguin. <laughs> I'm gonna start doing a Richard uh, the Richard Dreyfus yeah, thing, leaning in the chair, yeah. falling uh-huh. off. Did you see that on Real Time with Bill Maher? No, he's so high. He does the entire interview like this. His ass yeah. is fully he's hanging, fully off hanging the chair. out, and he's talking Whoa. like this. And Bill Maher never acknowledges Bill Maher it. Bill is such a narcissistic asshole. He never brings it up. No. Yeah. yeah. Actually, we'll pull this up for the Sam. Bill Maher. Yeah. yeah. The, the Bill, Bill Maher. Mm-hmm. What? Lost yeah. in his own shit. He played that N word game with Ben a few times. <laughs> yeah, he set the new record. Yeah. Yeah. It was a high score. Uh, Bill Maher nude. Bill Maher, how big? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bill Maher, Richard Jenny. Interesting. Oh, look at him. You go. can just click throughout the episode. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. No, no, no. It gets, it gets so much more. Yeah. 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 Is, oh. this, is it right here? No. What the H? Right there, right there, right there. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. 
He's not in the chair. Oh, no. <laughs> he looks like the Don't Smoke Pot commercial where yeah. you melt into the couch. He lost his bones. Uh, oh, I've man. never been so high I forgot how a chair worked. Mm. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I, I'm assuming he doesn't to, actually sit I swear like to that. God, he gets no. lower at some point. Dude, his shirt is tucked in at that angle. That's so bad. <laughs> Let it breathe. Oh, uh, man. Yeah. Me and Jace, this is great too. Me and Jace just rewatched Jaws last night too. He's so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. the great Matt Hooper, mm-hmm. the uh, uh, ocean oceanologist. What know, a great! I'm more of a Stockton know. Rush guy. <laughs> Who's Stockton Rush? That guy that killed everybody on the on the submarine. Oh, the yuppie oh. did. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 He had the name of a guy that kills people. Mm-hmm. 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 Stockton Rush. Stockton Rush. Wow. Yeah, just in his Patagonia jacket, just taking lives. Right. Huh. I thought that was like a Utah jazz player or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I know. <laughs> yeah. He made the summer league like, team. Played yeah. with Jerry West. <laughs> uh, but uh, Jerry I, West. I, I, Isn't that a guy? <laughs> yeah. Okay. From like late <laughs> 70s, early 80s. Uh, <laughs> I told, they didn't watch after no. they did the whole integration. No. Thing. Yeah. 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 I stopped watching. <laughs> I stopped watching. You called it the integration. Like I thought the NBA stands for. (laughs) Yeah. Okay. (laughs) Okay. All right. right. (laughs) Watch out, Dreyfus. Yeah. Yeah. Ben's the guy at NBA games playing. Like you should have seen George Mike, and he was strong as oak. Yeah. You could have moved the the underhand shots more consistent. (laughs) Ben stopped watching when they started dunking. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) I stormed out. Uh huh. Uh, I told Devin though. Oh, do you have to go somewhere? No, I'm trying to. You, just, you really have no respect for me in the headphone situation, so I'm trying. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm just going to slowly work. I put in Sam's. It's uh, all right. I'm going to slowly work. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. have headphones. That's it, true. I, ben I, said I'm second class. <laughs> he said that's Jace's thing. I mm-hmm. I told Devin. I said I'd rather rather than go to the bottom of the ocean in that submarine. I'd rather go in that the mechanical shark from Jaws that kept breaking. I'd rather go to a subway and get a foot long. <laughs> sure, me too. Yeah. Yeah. Sure, he says. Sure. <laughs> Thanks, Devin. I don't know <laughs> sure, I don't know. <laughs> it make me feel nude you, and alone. You have, equal, <laughs> you have equal chances of dying and exploding. That's true. Yeah, especially when they bring the five for five back. Mm-hmm. Oh, you know, God. That was the best. Did you hear they imploded? Yes, they imploded. That's so they the, didn't even yeah. know they died. I heard a new theory that they knew for about 15 minutes that they were pretty much done for. That's kind of awesome. But I, I heard that they didn't feel like Yeah, it. yeah, they didn't. Yeah, right. yeah. Yeah, they just kind of like into... squish my balls when I cross my legs. Mm-hmm. They don't know that's going to hurt. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Do they have exactly. a black box? No, they I don't no think recording. so. Werner Herzog probably has the audio somewhere and he mm-hmm. won't release it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He calls the black box the VIP section at the Globetrotters <laughs> game. <laughs> Can you believe this, Jace? Your brother? I know. I've had a real problem with him for a while now. It's difficult. No, it's, it's a lot. Yeah, you when we were, he was too racist for Texas. We had to leave. Yeah, yeah. you just ship me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You, this is like a pray away the gay camp where you send your most racist relative to California. So he's just like, he's, all, he's, all, he's also racist, but, you know, I'm not moved as far to the right. And that's why your parents sent both of you here, because they couldn't tell which was the gayest one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 We always competed for our parents' affection by being gay. Mm. You know? Who can glurp the most of dad's hog? <laughs> yeah. mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Is this the little boy who saw God? Because he- yeah, it's Colton Burpo. Colton Burpo. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> of course. And then uh, his father is a Todd Burpo. Yeah. The best. And then his mother is Sandra Burpo. Yeah, I'm more of a Todd Burpo guy. <laughs> yeah. You know. Well, Colton Burpo. well, the thing is, everybody knows about Colton Burpo, but yeah. Todd's the real mastermind behind the whole thing. He's the Machiavellian. Well, he's the one spinning the yarn. Yes, mm-hmm. he's the man behind the curtain. Oh, Colton man. is just the, a mere mask. He's just little Burpo, yeah. the Burpo boy. He, he he riddled the devil and beat God in arm wrestling. And he got to come back. Uh, Polk is obsessed with Colton Burpo as well. That's oh. how we kind of uh, became friends. Yeah, Colton Burpo were, actually you brought were, me and you together, I guess. You were you Burpo look. posting, as you called it, right? <laughs> yes. You were on the Burpo boards. Cosplaying as Colton Burpo. Yes. I think Andrew was trying for a long time. I think he finally got the handle Colton Burpo. And yeah. then I think... Uh, I think Elon like uh, bought Twitter. I think he threatened the- Draymond Green. Yes, <laughs> is what, I think that's what happened. If yeah. I remember correctly, he did oh, a big right. oopsie daisy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, real yeah. my bad. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What about the guy who doesn't know slang and he's apologizing? It's my dad. <laughs> Sure. That's what he said. I, I, huh? I love Subway. <laughs> so I'm just gonna, it gets into Subway more. Oh, uh, man. I love Andrew Polk. He actually. You know, this doesn't mean anything, but this was the, one of the it's one of the nicest things that he was done for me because I'm so insane. Long time ago, he said he was at a bar. He messaged me at a bar and he said, I'm talking to two guys that went to high school with Kobe's accuser. She's a fucking liar. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, my God, this is the greatest message I've ever gotten. Mm, yeah. 
I heard that too, being from Colorado. Really? The, so I had a friend who went to high school with her, and she tried to pull that same shit in high school, allegedly. Oh, this is the mm. best news I've ever gotten. Really? Did she do allegedly. that before Kobe? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I think that was her junior year, and then Kobe got in her senior year. <laughs> right. <laughs> I knew I was right, even at nine. Yeah. I was nine years old. I forced my mom to buy me a free Kobe shirt. Mm. <laughs> had his mug shot on it. I wore it all the time. She was like getting complaints from yeah. the school and neighbors. She thought you were begging for a gratis steak from Japan. Mm -hmm. Sure. I was going around just telling people like, I was like, it was just <laughs> anal. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> I do remember it's one of my favorite moments when you were when we Subway, were, five for five. Yeah. <laughs> when we were doing do you mind if I tell the story of you at the improv? Yes. In front of that, yeah. that whole black crowd. Yeah. There was a show that was like explain it was called like explain your search history. Yeah. Or explain your internet or whatever. Mm. And Devin did stand up at the beginning. It was all black crowd, and Devin was like killing. And then they brought up a post about you defending Kobe. Yeah. Whoa. And then you went on this like great. It was a great rant. You're like, you're like, well, you know, they found like eight, you know, different t types of calm like on her dress. Yeah. So, like, I, th I think I said if she had consensual sex with three guys that work at Shakey's, why wouldn't she with Kobe Bryant? <laughs> and everyone was like, ooh. <laughs> I was kind of disappointed in black people that night. I, was I know. Like, what the hell? Yeah. How is this not like Emmett yeah. Till level? It's right. racist. Yeah. It's a crazy white lady accusing a brilliant man. I know. You pulled like a Reverse Jesse Jackson. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you close by saying, I'm with the movement, y'all. Yeah. Where are my folks at? Yeah. <laughs> Devin played Fight the Power and he started doing the Rosie Perez yeah. dance. I was like, can't trust it. Well, that's when you were still going by your old stage name. Uh, that that boy talking, run, go tell him. Yes, that was. <laughs> yeah. I run, tell that. I was inspired by yeah. Martin Lawrence. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. yeah. You're a big Gary Owen guy. Uh, yeah. He Owen. gets away with it. <laughs> Love Gary Owen. How does he keep getting away with it? Well, he's a black wife who hates him. So. But they got divorced. Oh, they did. Oh. the voice. Mm. That's bullshit. Yeah, you it's can't crazy. Do that. Ever, I've been on a bunch of Gary Owen deep dives. It's really? just nuts what he's gotten away with. His wife is banging Matt Reif now, I guess. What? No, I'm kidding. That must have, I was trying to figure out yeah. what explains Matt him. Matt Reif is fucking every woman in the universe. So. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, where's where's my wife? <laughs> there's, you know I mean? there's a clip of Matt Reif saying he hates Atlanta. He, like, he always does badly there. And I'm like, this well, that's because that's mine. It's Kobe. Why, yeah, but why is my wife your screen? <laughs> <laughs> That's a Subway 5 for 5 meal. Hey, <laughs> knock it off. <laughs> Uh, I must say, guys, I'm a big fan of the pod. I'm really happy for your success. No, Thank thanks, you, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Sam's uh, book, of course, is available now oh, in yeah. stores. SamTalent.com. We should have mm -hmm. plugged that up top. We, you know what? Your fans are so inundated with comedy at this point that I'm sure they're, oh, this fat fuck's back to wear his weird shorts and talk about his book. Listen, hey, you're a guest. I'm the guy on the pod. I got yeah. you beat. <laughs> on the Wad Squad meter? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I got you laughed. <laughs> Although I got to tell you, man, I, I moved to these shirts and now I don't do the gut pull anymore. It is That's, pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You got to go like a big guy. You got to go like Tony Soprano mode, I basically. Know, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. God, I wish. You got to sit by the pool, stare at birds, mm -hmm. wear a robe. Yeah. yeah. Threaten yeah. to hit your wife, but don't do it. Mm -hmm. you know? Kill your nephew. Yeah. Your nephew, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Should have been Tony who sat on the dog. That would have made a lot more sense. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. Yeah, because yeah, he ate too much pastrami. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 He's just tired. He yeah. has the itis, yeah. uh, which is the abbreviated version of what Ben calls it. <laughs> well, I'm tired of you. I'm tired of people not knowing the truth about you. No, right? I, I have a I have a raging. Uh, I'm a bad. I'm a bad guy. Yes. We just did a, a Patreon episode before that. Before this, yeah, and I, I, know I made it exhausted. I made a very bad joke. What was it? What'd you do? Don't tell me. All you know what, listeners, you guys can find out just how problematic Ben Avery is on the Patreon. Yeah, on. Uh, I oh, guess they know. <laughs> that's what they're paying for. Yeah, yeah. The slurs behind the paywall. Yeah. Yep, uh, that's good. Yep. Andrew Polk one time, um, our very funny Andrew, funny, uh, he, uh, John Michael Bond was on the road. And yeah, yeah. He drove over with some other comic, and uh, the other comic showed up after driving all the way through the night to get to New Orleans. They roll up to Polk's house, and the guy comes in, and he's holding like two, two slices of bread and some cold cuts. And he walks in and John Michael Bond's like, hey, Andrew, how you doing? And they greet and they hug. And then before the guy introduces himself, he's like, hey, you mind if I make a sandwich? And Polk <laughs> says, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> uh, I love uh, 
Polk in public would just someone would be like, "What did you just say?" And he goes, "Oh, I'm going to kill the president." Yeah, <laughs> he would yeah. just like walk out uh-huh. of the room. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> to complete strangers. Yeah, he was just He's going, also yeah. like allergic to bread and water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he can't eat any food. Uh, He's pre-chewed. Mm-hmm. Yeah, God bless him. He's in the bowels of New Orleans now. I hear. Yeah, he works in the quarter. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah, it's he, my favorite he has to, city. Like, shoot his way out of work. It's the best city ever. Yeah. 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 It's like it's like bad lieutenant. Yeah, oh, apparently yeah. Yeah, port it's, of call. Yeah, <laughs> apparently it's like horrible down there now. It's no. in the top ten murderous cities in North America. It's oh, the what? only one in the United States. The rest are in Mexico. Mm. Yeah. yeah, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Well, if you're drunk enough, you just kind of end up yeah. dodging yeah, the bullets by the tripping. Worm, yeah, you know, getting exactly. a second line. Exactly. You just gotta run everywhere. You just move quickly. Mm-hmm. Nothing's gonna happen. Yeah, but you can't because the heat is so oppressive. That's true. There's a lot yeah. of. Uh, a lot of uh, humidity. Oh, very good. Yeah. <laughs> you could see Devin do the PR. Boy, I'm like, no. yeah. 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 It's a free one. Yeah. Yeah. Like one of Joe Biden's handlers. Yeah. Oh God! Uh-huh. Here comes Ben, the merchant of slurs. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Oh God. God mm. damn. I'm so happy Sam's here. I'm happy to be Me, here, man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This is this is great. We're we're gonna have a, a, a grand old time because you're you're staying in my guest room. We're gonna have a we're gonna have a lot of fun. Yeah, Katie ate her handful of pills and she said she's going to sleep <laughs> <laughs> forever. I don't know what that means, but uh, yeah. yeah, Katie locked herself in her cage that mm. she does every night. Yeah. 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 It's the only way she takes her pills is by the hand. Well, you had to hide them in that cheese, and yeah. you said, "Quit eating so much of it, you're getting fat." <laughs> it's like, come on, man, she's beautiful. Yeah, yeah. It was fun that you made us watch you shoot golf balls for an hour and a half How before good we I? were allowed on your pod. <laughs> it's insane. I make anybody that's a guest on the show, I make uh, they have to watch me chip and putt in they the backyard. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you have to watch you chip and putt and also eat a horrible homemade moon pie you made. <laughs> I knew you didn't like it. Me and Jace ate half of one. We're immense. Yeah, which really is, a, is not a great sign, yeah. Mm-hmm. To be fair, Devin couldn't pick it up because uh, it was so <laughs> dense. <laughs> Yeah, it was my first time making. I for for everybody who's listening at home, I made little Debbie yeah. oatmeal cream pies. Only at home, though. If you're at work, <laughs> pause yeah. it. Yeah, you know, skip ahead thirty seconds. Yeah, I'm assuming people can only listen to this in the privacy of their own home. Yeah, unless they work at like uh, I don't know, like the morgue or Bright something. Breitbart. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Nazi Germany. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you say Nazi <laughs> Germany? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like if you're a Vatican. time traveler. Yeah, yeah. I'm saying this show is so problematic. Hitler can hear it in his head uh, yeah. in the past. Yeah. 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 Oh, guarding vibrant. the camps is so, so tedious. <laughs> Yeah. Guarding the camps would have been boring. It would have been really yeah. boring. Look yeah. at the monotony. Yeah, it's like, hey, don't, I thought you guys were supposed to be funny. Do some bits. <laughs> huh? Complain. A little slapstick. Yeah, it is. I, I think it's hot in here. Anyone else? Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, little Roman Polanski's there, fucking all the kids. Yes. Yeah. yeah, little Roman. <laughs> little Ro- that's little Roman. <laughs> At it again. Uh, uh, yeah, that's that's why your neighbors sing. To, to more well yeah they're doing uh, Israeli karaoke right now mm. sure. it's amazing I wish they would do some covers though Me you know too. yeah yeah but oh. what are you gonna, they're not even doing like Mahdi's Yahoo or anything like that it's 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 a lot of it sounds kind of like a ghost that doesn't know he's a ghost yet yeah just sort of outside like trying to figure everything like out like a Palestinian just... <laughs> <laughs> good damn it Sure. No anti-Israel stuff on the show. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. I love we're, it. we're a very pro-Israel yeah, show. I'm I love so progressive, net. I don't uh, admit that Israel or Palestine exists. <laughs> <laughs> you like you like bomb them both? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, pave the whole thing. Mm. <laughs> Put in a fucking Ikea. Mm. <laughs> I'm a pro-Israel guy just because Quentin Tarantino lives there now. He lives in Tel Aviv. Does so, he? Yeah. No. Mm. You saw one of his movies and he was in it on the TV and you said, how did he get in the television? Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you're stupid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's so little now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> he, uh, I'm he, not in frame. Are you not? Are you sure? I don't want to be. Uh, yeah, I'm kidding. Not, I don't know. Oh, yeah. He might not oh, okay. be in frame I don't know. now, actually. I can't uh, Jace, be. can you tell? Yeah, let me. I can't. Crick, crack, crick, crick, crack, crack. Uh, Sam, can you wave your arm for a second? Oh yeah, you're. I would move forward, like just like lean forward just a little bit. Be right here. Yeah. yeah. Hey guys. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, that's great. Just you don't want to crush fellas. the dog. Unfortunately, this is the biggest <laughs> uh, room I could I could uh, find. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Your mansion. Yeah. 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 This is the first podcast where the four collapses midway through. <laughs> That'd be huge. Yeah. <laughs> yes. You figure out the headphone thing. Yeah. Finally. I decided to strike when you guys were worried about the camera. Yeah, that's we're good. good. God, these Jews are annoying. 
Okay. okay. Hey, so no, someone, hey, hey, someone, <laughs> I, I will. I will say this. Someone. Someone asked me on one of the live streams we did. If you had to drop a nuke on any city in the world, like yeah. where would you drop it? Springfield, Missouri. Really? Oh, hmm. easy. Because of the Simpsons? No, no, no. Just because of I've worked there so much and I never have a good time. Oh yeah. Yeah. God bless. I've them. never been, but you're not missing out. They invented cashew chicken there, which mm. went on to become the chicken nugget. Mm. Really? Mm-hmm. Remember that cake that Jace had for his 16th birthday? Mm-hmm. Oops, all nugs. <laughs> and then you were like, "Oh, I tried to type this out, but my autocorrect changed it to a different word." God damn you! Stop going through my diary, damn it. Yeah. Oh, dearest Ben, in the future, when you read this, your humble past will be laying forth in front of you. He won't share any of his writings uh, with me. He'll just keep bragging about putting up seven thousand words a day. Do you want? Do you actually? I thought that'd be annoying. Well, if he's, I shared oh, he's putting with up you. one word yeah. seven thousand times. A day. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's like the the scene in The Shining where Shelley Duvall is reading the uh-huh. book, but you, yeah. you know, you get the rest uh-huh. of the. Bed. He, refu- yeah. he refuses to email it to you too. It's going to be through Telegram or Stagecoach or whatever new hipster bullshit he's doing. Right, you're gonna you're gonna see a pigeon in the distance drop a book at your feet. Uh-huh. Yeah. I can't wait. I can wait for that pigeon to show up with your I, slurs I, abound. I have a typewriter, but I've removed all the keys except for five. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> that works. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. No, yeah. I, I counted as you guys were riffing. I was like, yeah. one, yeah. two. I'm like, that one's twice, So, but it only counted once. Oh, I thought you were just having one of your moments. Wait, what did I say? <laughs> you know, where you just like start rocking. <laughs> yeah. 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 One of your moments. You know, when he goes into yeah. his fits. Like yeah, he's yeah. the mom in Requiem for a Dream. Mm-hmm. Dude, that that's a book you should read. Because, you know, the mom in that movie is like kind of a secondary, and she's like not as jarring and fucked up as the rest of the characters. I'm thinking thin. Right, but yeah. in that book, she is the mo- she's the worst. It's so bleak and scary. Mm-hmm. I, I, I feel like that comes through in the film. I was thinking about that literally today, where I'm like, she's no, the most not. fucked up This is where you one. copy the thing I just said and act like you thought of it earlier. <laughs> God. How do you guys still put up with that? I don't know, man. Listen, yeah. Oh. No, I'm kidding, Ben. Um, I'm sure you did have an original thought. <laughs> Shouldn't he give me that espresso? Uh, <laughs> makes me nasty. I know. The, co- <laughs> the coffee makes you old Donnie Rickles yeah. over here. Nasty, dirty Sam over here. <laughs> yeah, dirty Sam. Jazz. Yeah, but his, uh, his book those? is available. It's running the light. It's at stores yeah. everywhere. Ben really respects it. He has a beer on it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> it's a non-alcoholic beer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They yeah. don't condensate the way regular beers oh, do. And yeah. you got one of the old ones. This is how much I cared about you. I sent it to yeah. you probably May of 2020. Yeah, and you it, um, it just collected dust. Signed it, and it's a first edition. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And you're bending the shit out of the cover. That's good. <laughs> my first book Mm -hmm. right it was the turner diaries (laughs) (laughs) oh man uh but samtalent.com for the novel thanks for having me on guys yeah (laughs) jesus christ (laughs) wow i want people to buy your book i appreciate that thank you but also you're going on the you're you don't have an apartment anymore well, you're, no. I had a house. You're nomadic. You're living like the uh, the Cherokee. I'm like a Bedouin. You're like the Comanche. I am. Yeah, hungry for scalp. They ate them. That's hard coin. Yeah, they didn't eat the scalps. They would eat the scalps. What else were they doing with them? They made uh, frisbees for a while. Oh, and yeah. then they did. They played that fun game. Is it my head? Is it a wig? Mm-hmm. <laughs> that oh, kept right. them busy on the yeah. plane. Right. Yeah. Bob Saget hosted that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah, that's right. Mm-hmm. Now there only one G in that one, Ben. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, Boom. <laughs> Fuck you! (laughs) It's so fun to be made fun of by Sam. Mm -hmm. Because it's like this giant teddy bear just saying awful things about you. But by the end of the podcast, he's just choking you with two hands. Yeah, Yeah. (laughs) Yeah, and then Devin takes me out by the river, and I get to pet one rabbit one more time. (laughs) And you take that gun. Mm -hmm. Uh Mm -hmm. I I have the nine iron in my hand. Yeah. I raise it up high. I got nine inches in my hand. I'm saying, who's hungry? That's, a, that's such a horrifying visual. Yeah. Like, you even said that to a woman? Who's who's Have you said that to a woman before, like in jest? It's not to a woman, a couple girls. <laughs> oh, wow. That's a couple ladies. Yeah, mm-hmm. A couple nice. gals, you know? Mm-hmm. Uh, no. You pull your dick out and you go, here comes the choo choo train. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All aboard. Mm-hmm. Hope you didn't have breakfast. <laughs> but, by the way, Sam, dessert before dinner. That's what I said. There's a gun for you. Thank you. It's pretty I mean, nice, right? Pretty fun. That is oh, good that night, does sweet work. prince. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> this thing? That would be great. didn't know if it was a loaded gun, by the way. Yeah. yeah. That would be great if we hand you a loaded gun in the podcast and you kill yourself <laughs> accidentally. That'd be big. <laughs> yeah. 
That'd be big for mm. numbers. That'd be big time. Mm. Yeah. This thing feels good. Right? It feels yeah. great, Imagine right? Put it inside of someone. <laughs> I had a, I have a like shooting them or <laughs> penetrating. Think them. Think about that. <laughs> Just think about it for a while. Okay. I have a friend who did a lot of meth, and he uh, was so Jace lost all the weight. Yeah, mm-hmm. <laughs> that's right. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh-huh. uh, uh, fucking. He used to do a lot of meth, and uh, he was f- fucking a lady. Because when you do meth, you like you fuck. Whose baby is that? <laughs> <laughs> Whose baby is it? <laughs> Uh, he uh, when you do when you do math, I think uh, often there's menage a trois sort huh? of a th- huh? huh menage. Huh? A, you mean a three way? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. What I say when you do math, people did I say it wrong? No, 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 well, like when you're when you're doing nefarious drugs, like you go in, you smoke meth, and the guy goes, "Hey, you can fuck my wife, by the way," because we're all high on math, right? And, yeah. You know the I, it's not like we draw the line anywhere. You only right. exist because I addicts. see you. Yeah, 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 yeah uh-huh. exactly. Yeah. So this guy was like fucking this, and he was like, "Oh, you don't want to." Uh, he was like, I don't know if I feel comfortable with that. And he he did later, fucker. But he's like, hey, look at this. And then he showed him a picture. And it was a, a, a he'd stuck a, a loaded a gun up her pussy and took a picture of it. Wow. From the back with a, a gun in her pussy. This is what mm-hmm. you've been writing about? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Please don't send it to me. <laughs> Oh, I'm I'm gonna mail you uh, my manuscript that is that's uh, in longhand and you everything. Can mail it to me as long as you don't woman it to me, right? Oh, exactly. Mm. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I I've never I I was involved in a three way once with two women and it was over almost immediately. Oh really? And you, I had to passive aggressively finger them. Oh man, oh, that's man. the worst. That yeah, sucks. That sucks. One of them looked up, but they were both kneeling, and one of them looked up. But she was holding my erect phallus. And she said, you better enjoy this because stuff like this doesn't happen all the time. And then as soon as it went into the other girl's mouth, I came. <laughs> <laughs> like right away, you know. And then I just had to like lay on the futon. and. Like, mm-hmm. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah it was, you said it was you did bummer. it a second time though, right? No, oh, no. The one threesome? And then that just to like try and like, yeah, because I'm down trying. I'll get hard again. Don't right. worry. That's, right. that's a lie. Yeah, you're like, I just need no some nuts. Yeah, exactly. Give me an almond. Yeah, no one's ever been hard twice in one 24 hour yeah, period. One of my Sisyphus. <laughs> <laughs> so, Did you go, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I made a mess. <laughs> I said she looked hungry. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were hungry. Yeah, I did baby voice. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> that's worse than putting a gun inside of a woman. <laughs> Oh, you know, do you, are you hungry? I made. <laughs> I made. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah. Yeah. Yuck. I had I had one opportunity for a threesome with two women, mm. and it was it, I got long COVID during COVID, and it was like three months. I remember in, that. Yeah, it was like three months into long COVID, and like some lady hit me up. I was like, oh, you fucking, you can fuck both of us. And I went over there, and I couldn't really like stand or walk. Yeah. So I just kind of like shimmied into her apartment. On a rascal I, scooter. Yeah. <laughs> you were wearing a little flat cap like Don DeLuise. Yeah. I, had, I had two canes, like the straight story. Yeah. yeah. A cowboy. You were hat. Walt Jr. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm here to get pussy. <laughs> yeah. I'm putting, I'm putting pancakes on her twat and yeah. eating them. <laughs> um, and now we were like, we were like just hanging out and like drinking like a beer. And then I was like, I was, it was so exhausted getting there. I was like, Man, I'm, there's no way I can get like an erection because I like I can't even like breathe. Yeah, and I go in the bathroom and I, I start jerking off and uh-huh. like after five minutes I'm like, well, this is the smallest my dick, uh, the limpest my dick has ever been. Sure. And I used to be like, I had to be like, you know what? I'm not really feeling it tonight. Mm, yeah. And then I just had to leave. You had to yeah. salute both yeah. of them. Yeah. 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 I got another threesome. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Two hotter chicks just told me they wanted to fuck me. So I got to get the hell out of Sorry. here. Yeah. <laughs> they like the cane. Yeah. No, I was literally like, I was like, you have a good night. Have fun fucking each other. I'm going to go drive home and <laughs> oh, lay no. in bed for another three months before I can like literally like walk around. Yeah. Again. Oh, yeah. No. It was brutal. Yeah. Did you just like walk out of the bathroom and say, you know what? Later. No, you, like, I walked out of the bathroom. The situation. I walked out of the bathroom. I was like, I think I was like literally like, eh, it's getting like, you know what? I'm just gonna get out of here. And they both they like looked at me like, what the hell? And then oh. they, I hope it gave them like a horrific complex that they're yeah. like, we were, <laughs> they're like, we were bored and we were gonna fuck this guy and he didn't want to yeah. when he got here. I've thought that when I like have had issues with getting hard mm-hmm. and there's like some before my wife obviously, sure of some course, just like nubile young thing laying there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and you're like trying to get hard and then they're like, wait, what's this guy's the worst. This guy's disgusting. Why couldn't he get hard for me? Mm-hmm. I'm so yeah. hungry. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Ooh, I've been, I've been fasting all, right. all day. Yeah. Yeah. You can't get hard and you go, somebody's shy. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh, is he going to see his shadow? Yeah. Is he coming out? Yeah. It's going to be two more weeks of cock. 
Right. It's always funny because the woman gets in your head and you're just like, I ate too many pancakes today. Yeah, exactly. so, yeah. 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 It's like, I'm uh, horribly unhealthy. Mm-hmm. I'm yeah. sorry. And you're exactly. like, and also jacking off, it's going to be way better than right. this. So yeah. I, uh, I just make them feel like shit. I am. <laughs> got some cellulite. Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> you saw one dimple. I see yeah. one. I go, I don't know. You got a weird mole. <laughs> I did not see it at that at the bar. Yeah, didn't sign up for this. Didn't sign up. Is that hair lip surgery you thought? Yeah. Was passing? No, 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 no. Here no, in no. a different light, uh-huh. you know. We're not under the neon anymore, sweetheart. Yeah, yeah, honey, you're not dancing in that tawdry carpet no more. Yeah. yeah. Now we're fucking under these uh, bright fluorescent lights in your home that yeah. we can't turn off. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're like that. Su- have you seen that subreddit? True rape me. <laughs> no. What? It's it's great. I've true been in- rape me. True no. True rape oh. me. Oh, oh. is it true rape me? No, wow. no, 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 no. Wow. That's for the Patreon. That is a subreddit. <laughs> I start talking like Warren. That's for the the Patreon. Oh, yeah. Um. But no, it's it's called True Rape Me, and it's I've been obsessed with it because it's women. It's like the hottest woman you've ever seen. She like uploads a photo of her. You're like, this is a mm. model. Like this, I wouldn't even look at this woman. She's right, so yeah. beautiful. And then every comment is like, they're like five, four point nine, yeah. and then somebody will be like seven, and then the the model be like banned for overrating, and they're you're kicked <laughs> out of the sub. They're all Mark Zuckerberg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all ten thousand comments. <laughs> Yeah, I've, I've been going through it every day. I'm just obsessed with it. Yeah. You know, whatever keeps you busy, buddy. I'm yeah. happy about that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. I just it's love, part of his morning routine. Yeah, yeah. I just love it when women feel bad. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Of course. Yeah, we get it. Hey, we get course. it. Hey, we're all podcasters yeah. here. Yeah. As you do. Uh-huh. I remember uh, meeting your is, wife. Are you guys married? No. No, okay, that's that slam piece as you introduced her. Um, <laughs> your lovely lady, and it was she was it was just she was radiant, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah it was also you know it was New York. I was like, wow, it's right. so pretty. Yeah, right. Yeah, mm-hmm. she's she's. I think she's hot. Yeah, yeah she is yeah. hot. And then that baseball player tried to get in her gut. That's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, I don't think we should say his name, but yeah, he was he mm-hmm. was interesting. Mm-hmm. He did yeah. not like the area. It was David Junior. Wells. He yeah, was, um, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was John Rocker. <laughs> yeah. John- <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. John Rocker when he's about to have sex, he sprints at the woman. <laughs> yeah, uh, like the Terminator. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that was an interesting night. I was like, I think I might end up fucking Sam tonight, yeah. and he can just have my girlfriend. Yeah. I would have been there for you in that moment. Mm-hmm. Thanks, man. Yeah. Thank I was you. Said, you know what, Devin? I am in fact hungry. <laughs> Did you guys bump into Carter McGregor once? Can you talk about that? Yeah, yeah. He, um, he. It, it was, it was crazy. His foot was like yeah, I backward. He, I thought he had a baby. He was in a. He, his foot was in a stroller out front of the Beverly Hills Hotel, mm-hmm. and he was rocking it. And I turned, and I thought he was like with a kid. And then it was his foot. And then he immediately got up and definitely wanted to fuck Ida, mm. and kept asking like what room we were in, <laughs> and like wanted to smoke weed with us. Yeah. He's awesome. Yeah. Dude. And then like the head of the commission for the mm. UFC, like the guy that like suspends people or the whatever, Dana White, Hunter something, Hunter, Hunter Biden. Versus Helmsley. Yeah. yeah that yeah. guy walks up, Connor has to have like a moment with him where he's like oh hey and the hunter's like how you doing connor nice to see you blah 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 the guy walks away walks inside the lobby and then he's like waving at us through the window and connor's like smiling he goes i hate that motherfucker that cock sucking piece of shit like just starts <laughs> railing on this guy and that we're rolls. all smiling and looking at him i love when connor does photo shoots of him just smoking a blunt in his escalade yeah oh, yeah we just has he's every angle and he yeah. he looks so cool. He's very cool. He also had a full, like a half chub the whole like he's always chubbed up. Whoa. His dick is showing in the picture. Wow. Like it's just showing through the sweatpants. Huge cock. Oh, it's giant. He's Irish though. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, he probably injects Ir- it with shit. They call it the Irish curse, right? Yeah. Yeah, no meat, all potatoes. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. the that's the saying. Oh, I didn't know. Yeah. <laughs> and now you guys say stuff. <laughs> Uh, no, no, we're all like a thought bubble appears over our head, and we go. But how could Jace know that? Yeah. Wait, hold on. Yeah, I fucked a lot of Irish guys. That was actually the three way I had to leave was two leprechauns. Yeah, because yeah, you ate all their lucky charms. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, I had I tried to fuck him with a potato, and then mm. I got out of there. Imagine banging a really small person for you and I. I mean, I've, I've done it before. It's it's very difficult. I'm talking like two and a half feet tall. Like a dwarf? I, I, yeah, and I repeat my statement. <laughs> what? No. You plug the tiny? <laughs> Whoa. No. The tiny. Yeah. no, 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 no. Um, no, I think I've, I like fucked like a five foot person sure, before. Yeah, yeah. That's very yeah, short. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. you guys are like each other's sweetest taboo. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Little ladies like yeah. to get Adult and child. by yeah. the bear pig. <laughs> yeah. I know. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Yeah, two and a half yeah. nuts. 
Yeah, like a little person. Like banging like Hasbullah. Yeah. 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 Have you like seen the freak? Yeah. Have you seen yeah, exactly. the Vern Troyer sex tape before? Of course. Yeah. I have the internet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. We have that out west. Not to brag. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> you have a tattoo of Right. Yeah. yeah. You're like, uh-huh. let me show you my wallet. Yes. Just if I could in take there. this shirt off, if it wasn't stuck to me like baklava wrapping, I would show it to you. <laughs> yeah. Vern Troyer does isn't he just doing this the whole time? With his fist, like he's put, putting his arm all the way up her pussy. You would yeah. think that, but no, mm. yeah. Oh, no, is, is that not what it is? He's fucking her, but it looks like a baby fucking a grown woman. It's <laughs> insane. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, dude, it's insane. It's crazy, dude. Yeah. He's uh, all bald and just. <laughs> mm-hmm. That's yeah. great. So if you're if you're famous but you're a baby, you can still get like pussy. Oh, for yeah. sure. That's awesome. That's yeah. what killed the. Uh, no, never mind. <laughs> right, killed the radio star. <laughs> no, what were you gonna no, say? no, no, no. Yeah. All right. I'm sure okay. Haspel is getting like sucked off. Like women just probably pick him up like a watermelon. Is- Suck him off. He can't. Religious? Yeah, he can't. Yeah. Oh, he can't. No, he's no. super religious. Yeah. Ah, oh, well, I mean, come on. He's in one of those countries where like women can't dance, but men can if they're spinning. You yeah. know. <laughs> yeah. One of those countries where you can put their dancing to rave music and yeah. it looks cool. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. I didn't know he was like a really religious guy. Yeah. yeah. This whole thing. Dagestani Jesus. maniacs. That's why uh, Habib got. That's why they all got so crazy about um, what Connor was saying because they were like, "It's against our like." He's like disrespecting our religion now. Oh, yeah. yeah. So, so yeah. it's, it's Muhammad. What is it? Uh, yeah, it's a goat or something. I don't yeah. Know. Oh, okay. It's a Satanist. Yes, Muhammad sure. is the goat. He is the goat. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The Great gayest numbers. of all time. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. yep. I can't believe he doesn't get pussy. Muhammad? No. Hasbula. He's like the I most know. famous guy on the planet. What a he waste. doesn't get pussy. What a waste of being he viral. He can crawl inside of someone. Mm. Yeah. His whole body. He could tell his family that he's like living in a new cave and just like live in the pussy. Or <laughs> he lives in a pelican's beak yeah, and right. just flies around the world. Yeah. He's got he's got a penthouse cave. Oh, yeah. It's the highest cave on the mountain. It's a post office box. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> a new cave. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yes. All his relatives thinks he's snooty. Yeah, yeah. he's an uppity. Uh, guy he would be the best by the way if he took bin, uppity fella <laughs> if he Jesus. took bin laden's place he would be i mean because it took us like 20 years to find bin laden this guy is so small he can hide in uh you know overhead compartments and yeah shit. he can hide in drawers yeah. well, if he was we'd gonna, never find him if he was a mastermind terrorist mm-hmm. it would have to be him and two of his friends stacked up wearing one of those robes <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Little rascals. yeah exactly they're sneaking into the mosque mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah they would have buried him at sea and just like a little fish comes up and eats him yeah. <laughs> yes. like a guppy yeah yeah. And then a car beats that one. Yeah. And then a shark eats that one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's right. Mm-hmm. New drawing. Hey, there we go. Hey. Hey. I used to draw. <laughs> no longer draw. You still draw? Uh, a little bit. I haven't been doing it too much. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't draw. You can see me at the Bray Improv if you know what I mean. <laughs> it's a big room. Right. It is and a very it's too big. big. Yeah, it's, it's really like big. 700 people. Why would they have insane. me in there? I don't know, it's insane. Man. I've got like 200 tickets sold. <sighs> yeah. right, make well, it 201. I'll be there. You can't come. What? <laughs> yeah, I don't want you there. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. I was going to sit way in the back and, and, yell, and yell things <laughs> yeah. to try to disrupt the show. Light a cigar in the back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was going to uh, go in and uh, fucking just, just uh, to tackle you on stage. That'd yeah. be great. I was going to run down the aisle and A and viral scream. moment. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ben's There's... developing a Cape Fear relationship with you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> He's going to be tied under your rental car on the way to Brea. Oh, yeah. Please. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'll tie you up myself. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Remember yeah. when you went through your cigar phase where you're like, I'm a cigar guy. I want to yeah. smoke cigars. I I go through. Remember how uh, Hank uh, gets obsessed with criminal uh, minerals and Breaking Bad? I thought you were going to say Hank Hill and I was going to be interested, but we can do this too. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Did you ever see Breaking Bad? No. Oh, really? Yeah. Of course I do. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Play along, Devin. <laughs> of course you did. Yeah, I saw it. Uh huh. Remember uh, my Walt Jr. joke from earlier? Oh, that's right. It yeah. literally yeah. broke Stupid. the room in half. Stupid. Yeah. Uh, but I do that like I got obsessed with birding for like two months. I know you did. I think I'm in a I mean am I in a limbo right now or am I obsessed with something? Well, you're yeah, more of a Macarena. Huh? Wait, what? Sorry. Oh, I was saying you have autism. Oh okay. yeah. thank you very <laughs> yeah. much. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I just have autism. No, you have a very inquisitive mind and you just, you know, you like to do stuff. Oh, I guess I I got super obsessed with young for like a month and a half and I was reading a young tail. Baby hole, as you right. kept calling it. Yeah. We're going to change this pod to pun time. <laughs> well, hey, I've already done three and a half hours. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep up. 
<laughs> I had an espresso uh, at 8.30. Yeah. You did. Not bad. <laughs> That's true. You've done like nine podcasts today. That's right. Yeah, yeah. you did. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. We're just the last one on the old tour there. Yeah, but this one is so fun. Mm. I've had this one circled on the calendar. I was like, I don't want to blow it. I want to impress Devin. I want to trick Ben into thinking I'm Jace. <laughs> We were going to do a whole hat switch situation, <laughs> mm-hmm. but we thought it might send you into one of your death spirals. So. <laughs> death spirals. Yeah. I, look out, <laughs> I look out the window tonight, your dog's hitting the golf balls and you're retrieving them. <laughs> I've got three legs. Yeah, yeah. It's like a lost highway situation. I wake up in like prison. I don't know who I am anymore. Yeah. I just yeah. switch places with someone else completely, mm-hmm. live a totally different life. Finally, not enough podcasts talk about lost highway. <laughs> Oh, one of the greatest films ever made. All right. What? <laughs> also, uh, it's the only... Call the cops. <laughs> <laughs> it's happening again. Right. <laughs> You've seen Lost Highway. Of course. You've seen all of Lynch's work, I assume. No, I have not. I, I'm not very well versed in Lynch, actually. I didn't watch Twin Peaks. Oh, that's fine. That's... I've, I've seen, like, uh, the Get Rid of the Pencil Head. Oh, yeah. Ra- Eraser Head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm. Why were you stumbling for it? It's right there. I was doing a bit, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally right, right in front of me. What are you, like a comedian or something? <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm a regular Richard Dreyfus. Yeah. <laughs> uh, ben likes David Lynch just because of the last name. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's good. Jace from Clown Town. <laughs> Uh, rules. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Sam Tell and his book is running the light. It's available everywhere. <laughs> okay, dude. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can just hear them, uh, their keyboards right now, and be like, we know about the book. We know about the book. the book. You fat carny. <laughs> they call me a carny now. Do they really? <laughs> yeah, because they think I'm obsessed with selling merch. And I just wrote something I'm incredibly proud of and I'd like people to read. Mm. Yeah. He's a seller. <laughs> Yeah, easy to straight up. Get him, dog. <laughs> That's what he says. It's too easy. It's, yeah. yeah. I thought it was going to be way easier, I'll be honest. You wrote one in like an hour and a half. <laughs> <laughs> You did. You were like, you hit me up in the morning. You're like, I think I'm gonna start writing. And then oh, yeah, at noon, yeah. you're like, I finished it. Yeah, ninety thousand words right yeah. here. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Is it that thing you were telling me about your initial? Yes. Plan? Yeah, the initial one. Yeah. Let me read the book, man. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not done. Let with me that read one. the book, man. I think the second one's better. You wrote a whole book before you wrote this one. Hey, man. Let me read that book. <laughs> okay. Well, since you're adopting this affectation, that's Ooh, fine. Adoption. They won't let me have the baby. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. That's real. <laughs> it is funny you going on like a, a podcast circuit to like promote your book. And you like you right. go on Rogan and you talk like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right out of the gate, you start talking like that. Right. Ain't no woke agenda, honey child. <laughs> They're making the kids trans, baby. <laughs> New Dylan Mulvaney got another thing coming. Mm-hmm. What the fucking shit? You start singing Oh Happy Day. <laughs> yeah. It is like you've done like nine podcasts about like how you got started in comedy. Yeah. And then you come to Slur Town. Yeah. Yeah, dude, I'm, I'm so excited. I'm a fan. You know what's funny, Sam? What? Is a... Uh, uh, I wonder if you could have had an accent like that and walked into Rogan, but you have to do it from the time you meet him, and then he just thinks that's actually <laughs> actually you, mm-hmm. and wonder if you could stay in it for three hours. I could do that accent for three hours. You could stay in the pocket with that Whenever for three hours. Whenever the not rolling, that's how I'm talking. Mm, yeah. Up in this big old head of mine. He thought you were Punky Johnson. <laughs> he did, yeah. Uh-huh. You got a butt light back there? He thought I was Punky Brewster. It's like, so you, so you, cut, you, cut your, you cut your tits off? What's going on? You had big, fake, uh, big, huge tits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were a child star, then you got huge tits. Yeah. So you're like a Soleil Moon guy? Is that what's going on? Are you trans? Are you trans? Are you Are you tra- tra- am I trans? Are you telling me that I'm trans? Because you're here on my podcast. Yeah. Are you trans into me? Huh? Are you trans in me? You got to tell me. I know the law. By the way, everyone's dying to know. I'm not going to ask you where you get your ideas from, yeah. obviously. Everyone's dying to know where you get that Blood Meridian hat. Oh, so I've had guy, so many people ask me. Some guy sent it to me. Oh, wow. Man, yeah. did he make that himself? He cuz he found me on Reddit and then he was like, "Hey, I made this hat. What do you I, I can get you one, I think." How did you know you love Blood Meridian so much? Cuz I was active in the Cormac McCarthy subreddit. Uh, yeah. Mm, yeah. Mm-hmm. I was actually like, a very good sub. Yeah, and then he was like, "Aren't you that trans comic from <laughs> the Joe Rogan experience?" And I was like, "Me?" <laughs> A comedian? Me. Ah, meat. Meat. 
I just remember I used to. I yeah, sorry, guys. You might be Ben's brother. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> Who's gay? <laughs> yeah, you raised your hand. God damn it! I'm done. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah, I can get you one of those hats, man. Cool. Yeah, I would love one of those hats. I love, I love an outer one. dark hat. That's my favorite book by that's him. That's insane that you think that's your favorite book by him. No, dude, it's so good. That's crazy. I'm dude. not the only one that thinks that. Would I have to say either Sutri or yeah, Blood Yeah, it's Meridian? you and the guy you see in the mirror when you talk about <laughs> this. Outer dark, he, fi- he comes into his own. It's raw. It's it's it's. It's legend. It's as you said. It's Flannery O'Connor meets. Uh, wake me up when he's. <laughs> God. It's the airplane GIF where he's telling a story and it zooms out and then yeah. the guy's hanging from a. I'm gonna go full Dreyfus. <laughs> 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 That's fun. Yeah. Yeah. No. yeah it's, it's fine. You, you don't respect my. Uh, obviously, Blood Meridian's the best. The best book. But uh, and then Sutri is like the second best. I book. just want to have a conversation that the other two people on the podcast can join in on. That's all. <laughs> they, Call me they, being considerate. Oh, I'm sorry, Devin hasn't read Cormac. No, Jace, no. Jace, I like holes. You Jace, read Outer Dark. <laughs> 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 <I like holes. laughs> That's the YA for me. Yeah, mm-hmm. I love that yeah. one. Mm-hmm. No, I did. It was funny. I did give Ben. Um, uh, uh, I've, I've read a little Cormac, but I gave Ben Gilead by Marilyn Robson oh, for wow. his uh, birthday. And uh, I was just trying to get him to read like a female person. Uh-huh. And then he was like, it's so sweet. And I just I hate it. It's yeah. so emotional. Yeah. yeah, I agree with that kind of shit, man. I need bleak. I need low stakes. I need, I need high stakes for low reward is what I need in a novel. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I need it. To, it's so loud. I, I mean, mean, it's, it's crazy. It's, I'm, it's I'm a lot. Back, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I you want to sing or you want to dance? <laughs> I need it to be about life and death, though. Yeah. And then Jace gives me this book where a guy's like, oh, I'm in a hospital bed. And sweetie, I love you so much. And mm-hmm. you're going to learn and grow so much that brothers and sisters aren't having sex with each other. I know. Uh, there's no infanticide. Mm-hmm. What book is it? Cormac no, uh, wrote a book like, is that the diving bell and the butterfly? What is that? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's called Gilead. It's, it's, called, it's by a different uh, writer. Uh, I gave it to him. It's, yeah. a, it's a sweet book written by a lady. Gilead yeah, and too. Keeves. You might have heard of it. So. <laughs> They're good. He lives in my neighborhood. <laughs> Keeves? Keeves, yeah. Keeves yeah. is out here? I think. Mm. He might have left. Hey, direct my special, you son of a bitch. Oh, Gillian. I think I was doing the fucking Key and Peel. Never mind. Oh. I think that's where they got the name from, though. So um, you, you live in Compton? No, Keegan. They're, 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 come on. They're like white at this point. <laughs> I, think one of them, I think one of them's Indian. Keegan Michael Key, like I've seen him walk his dog around. Yeah, there you I go. Yeah. yeah. Boy, what an odd podcast this is. <laughs> By the way, I uh, thought it was going well. It is. It is. It is. Mm-hmm. Uh, Devin lives. We haven't started recording. <laughs> Devin lives next to Tuco. Yeah, Raymond Cruz. Oh yeah, yeah. The Tuke man. Yeah, yeah. He's Tuco awesome. Sam. Yeah. So he's working on his like old car. Mm. And uh, you see that, and then you see John C. Riley playing a trumpet. He laughed a long time ago. Oh, did he? Yeah, yeah. He got tired of flipping off all the kids. Yeah. <laughs> as soon as I had to quit doing yoga in the window, he moved out. <laughs> John C. Riley got in a hot air yeah. balloon and rode away. <laughs> yeah. 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 He's always dressing like a carnival bike. Yeah, he's like wearing those, those hats that he punches a hole in whenever he's upset. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he is a whimsical man. Yeah, yeah. I hope I never get whimsical. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's very annoying. It's a bad look. Yeah. For, it's a bad crisis to be in. Is yeah, whims- especially for like a big chode. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's tough. Yeah. yeah. You, you don't ever want to become that. Because wasn't he in that movie uh, uh, Laurel and Hardy? Yeah. 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 With Steve uh, Coogan. Yeah. 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 Who, who, he played, uh, you know, Hardy, obviously. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He played the piano that they <laughs> carry up the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> he was the ampersand. Yeah. yeah. That movie was bad. I saw it with my mom. She was pissed. I love seeing, uh, sorry for your loss, by the way. We found her. <laughs> 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 and we and we uh, put her down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Your mom was like P twenty two, the mountain lion out here. Yes. Yeah. I don't know if you don't do that, but you got like hit by a car, right? Yeah. yeah. And then LA like made an announcement, like good news, we brought P twenty two to the hospital. Uh-huh. And then like forty minutes later, they're like, and we put him down there. <laughs> it's a tweet thread. It's no, the it's next like, tweet. It was like literally a response. Yeah. yeah. I was like, ah. Oh. This what Banana Republic said about my mom in the email. <laughs> we thought she was in the changing room for a long time. Mm-hmm. No. She's trying to fuck all those yeah. bananas. That's right. You know? Yeah, <laughs> she got hit by a car in there. <laughs> it's an RC car. Her heart exploded. Mm-hmm. I love that we're doing ads for <laughs> Bill Maher sponsors. Everyone, check out SignalWire.com yeah. yeah. <laughs> slash, slash random backslash random. Uh, Support good art. Mm-hmm. 
I, I did Phil. show Ida the Richard Dreyfus. We had a barbecue last week. I showed her the Richard Dreyfus thing. She almost like fell in the pool, like collapsing. Oh yeah, just from laughing so hard. You kind of can't believe it's real when you see it. You're I like, know. Why won't he adjust? And it's it's just so funny to to fe- like scroll twenty minutes and he's in a new incredible fucked up position. Yeah, yeah. You skip forward twenty minutes and he's like in the like Family Guy Peter dying like Dude, pose yeah, yeah. stairs. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I'm eagerly anticipating watching it. That'll be fun. It's a fun time. It's fun. I love he just gets Bill him really Martin. high, right? That's the whole thing. Yeah, I then, guess unless he just sits like that when he's relaxing. Yeah, maybe. I, I do fucked up shit like that sometimes. Yeah. When I feel, I mean, imagine me really comfortable around someone. Things can get weird. I think I've seen. I, I feel like you're comfortable around me. Yeah, yeah. Remember I mean, when we found that billabong and we went and put our bodies in it and we were like, "This is the greatest thing ever." <laughs> yes, yeah, absolutely. That was awesome. That was awesome. Yeah, I've, dude. I've ever, wait, what what about that fruit? Yeah, me and Sam uh, found a fruit called uh, soursop. Soursop, right? Which it's so, they can't fly it to America so because you it tastes to, so bad. Yeah, it's full of koala eggs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's invasive. It's this amazing. Uh, it's like a, the inside of it's like uh, like a bubble gum, like a, yeah. like a marshmallow. You break it open, it's so it's, it's so soft they can't ship it. Yeah, dude, it was. Nuts. I think they can. You can get it canned here. But that's yeah. it. I've heard of it here. Yeah, really. I think so. I've heard I, of soursop here. You can't get it somewhere. Like, I don't think you can get a whole. There's gonna be a forty comment thread yeah, of about course. this. Yeah. yeah, I don't think there's like soursop trees like on a no, I don't think farm somewhere. Yeah. yeah, you're gonna get a comment from a guy called like the soursop guy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just pissed off. <laughs> First off, fucking dumbass. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the inside of it looks like Hellraiser's face though. The way Yo, it breaks yeah. apart and it's it's uh, it's very pale. Right, and there's like little beads in uh-huh. there. And you put it in, you chew it like a like it's like bubble gum, and it's very sweet. So he had like, like one best- little mm-hmm. segment, mm-hmm. and then I just ate the rest of it effectively I was like, arr, arr, arr. and then we tried to find a car to take us to get more sour sop and yeah, they wouldn't yeah. they wouldn't let us off the compound i remember i made you laugh really hard because i was on the phone you go who, who was it who called i go uh good news uh your mom's alive yeah. <laughs> <laughs> i think or maybe i said like she came back she, she yeah. came back from the dead yeah yeah uh, man god she i also got i got sam really good once too where i uh i was in australia oh, did he actually fall for that <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're like yeah. I got him really yeah. good. Too. I was like, yeah. you got cameras there, there, there. Yeah, Sam's Sam's weeping. <laughs> <laughs> I miss you so much. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you're on our new uh, hidden camera show. Fuck you, dumbass. <laughs> I got him real good. Yeah. Mm. Oh. oh. What yes. was the other time you got? Oh, him the other good? time I got Sam because it's yeah, funny. Cause effective prank. Sam has. Sam has. There's something about him. I, it's, I have the same way where for some reason if something can just hit you a certain way and you can't stop laughing, oh, you yeah. get into this weird fit where you're laughing for like two minutes and you just can't stop. And uh-huh. it's not like it's. You know, it's like you saw a guy like, you know, slip on a banana pill and his pants came down and his right. wiener went everywhere and he started peeing on himself. Right. Sure. It wasn't something like it wasn't the funniest thing you could possibly imagine. Yeah, it wasn't art yeah. itself. Yeah. 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 It wasn't the face of comedy personified. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It wasn't a passage in your book. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I, I said, uh, I go, oh, look here, because the, the trash, uh-huh. there's three holes in the trash right. in Australia. And it was recycling compost. Koalas. <laughs> yeah, you, <laughs> you a, a koala bear. shaped hole. You shove a whole bear in one hole. <laughs> yeah. After you're done fucking it in Australia, you have oh, to throw yeah. it out. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. Sam was staring at it because it the trash divided into three different things. I go, oh, so here in Australia they divide it between your setups, punchlines, and tags. <laughs> <laughs> and I think I think I got you so good at the airport that you like couldn't stop laughing. And I felt so proud of myself. I like I had like extra pep in my step. I'm like walking around. That was after you tried to beg your way into the Qantas lounge. Yeah, yeah. You went up to them and you were like, uh, we're gonna go in. And they were like, no, you're not. <laughs> and you were like, I've got like Five thousand points, <laughs> and they were like, "That's nothing." Yeah, nothing. yeah. <laughs> like, like, how is five thousand or something nothing? Yeah, they're also like, "It's miles." I remember them telling you it's miles, right, and you were yeah, like, yeah. "Well, I've got the points." <laughs> <laughs> we just had to go. You're on. showing them your Chipotle app. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm Glock mode verified. <laughs> uh, I think you're just a bit retarded, mate. <laughs> <laughs> You've got a droopsy and your oopsie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm going down I, there. If you're listening to this and you live in Australia, I'll be there all of August. Go to samtalent.com. There you go, samtalent.com. You can also find the book Running the Light. Oh, okay. Very good book. You know what they're going to find? Your body. 
<laughs> Much like my mom's. <laughs> just pictures of my body. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's tasteful nudes. Uh-huh. Yeah. Soursop man's going to be like, hey, other Jace, <laughs> you better not come down to Australia, mate. <laughs> Jace too. I I left the plush kangaroo on Sam's bed. You did. Yeah. Oh, that's very yeah, sweet. It's all you can eat. <laughs> a what? A plush kangaroo. I got a, like a toy. I got a stuff. toy oh. kangaroo. Like you're yeah. like the kid in Bad Santa. <laughs> <laughs> you're like Thurman Herman, leaving him like gifts. Dude. <laughs> it was Thurman Herman, right? Thurman Herman. Thurman 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 Thurman. Yeah. In that movie, I did. They couldn't. I couldn't. Watch the rest of the movie. Uh, yeah. you're as soon as so they hard. said his name. Yeah. Well, also the way and he goes, he goes, Thurman. Your name's Thurman <laughs> Merman. <laughs> yes. He's just standing there like chocolate all over his fucking face. It's such a fucking it's one funny of the best movie. Comedies ever. When people are pelting him with like cans of beans <laughs> yeah. and like full yeah. sodas as he's right. walking. Yeah, yeah, they're like calling him like yeah. a faggot yeah. and stuff. Yeah. Just yeah. whipping fucking rocks at him. Yeah, it's so funny, dude. <laughs> his underwear is pulled up to like his tits. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! <laughs> By the way, that guy grew up to do Bad Santa too, and he all he looks still crazy as fuck. Yeah, he didn't grow out of that at all. He just looks bigger. Yeah, I mean that would be insane if he looked like you know like a Giga Chad as an adult. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. No, he still looks really fucked up. Poor kid. Mm. No, well, he, when he grew up, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, <laughs> well, he's like twenty three, I guess, in Bad Santa too. Mm. Why'd they have to do that? Why'd they have to make it And other? by the way, same haircut. The kid? Yeah. The you really hung up on broccoli. the kid. I mean, he played his role. He plays like a retarded child now and then a retarded adult. Like, <laughs> yeah. Keep him that way. You yeah. seem to have wanted like a Brad Pitt to take over. <laughs> yeah, you want to recast it. Yeah. Yeah. Timothy yeah. Chalamet. Yeah. <laughs> I like men who can reinvent themselves, mm-hmm. you know? Have another beer, you waste oil. Yeah, come on. <laughs> God. Look at you. Jeez. I like men who are iconoclasts. Mm-hmm. Like they say the Buddha, he continually shatters yeah. the image of himself and it's uh, recreated right. again as you're yeah. carrying on down they the say path. that, yeah. yeah. You love that. That's yeah. why you watch mukbangers all day. <laughs> yeah. now, I, I mean, remember reading that in Pretentious Retard Quarterly. <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah. I think you got the guest editorial in that. Yeah. <laughs> Is Sam, but a guy who reads about the Eastern world, but he yeah. still has to go, let me see, never eat sour wine. Watermelon. Okay, yeah. Eastern. Eastern's over there. Or what if he thinks it's Easter and there's a bunch of like eggs hidden? Yeah, and rabbits. He goes and to China and he's looking for hidden eggs. <laughs> <laughs> Far Easter. Mm. Mm. I would subscribe to Muckbangers, uh, like a Muckbangers Digest, where I'm just flipping through magazines, going, "Oh, Nick Akato did lose some weight." Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All flipping the ads it, yeah. in the magazine for you to kill yourself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's the, suicide yeah, it's the suicide suicide yeah. pods from like Norway. Yeah. Yeah, you just get it and they burn you alive. Yeah, yeah. that's a big new uh, part of medicine now that my wife learned about. Is just killing yourself? Yeah, euthanasia. Mm. Yeah. And I was like, I've been Googling that for years. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> like it's two points is two points, whether it's a six slam dunk or a 12 foot jumper. All right. <laughs> it's legal in uh, Canada, or Washington. Yeah. Yeah. Or in a, Washington. Or and I think Colorado too now. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's pretty cool. tight. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so yeah. you can go and just give people like a debit card and you, you fill out a thing and then they kill you. I don't think you can use a debit card. Oh, uh, it's like a renting a card. I don't know. <laughs> Why do you say debit card? You said your wife is the doctor of death. Nah, yeah, she's she not the accountant. The doctor of <laughs> yeah. death. She's Dr. Yeah. Dr. Jackoff Kevorkian. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. My beautiful wife, uh, the angel of mercy. <laughs> yes. I find out, I find out, by the way, this is a crazy thing. They can abort uh, babies. Uh, if you like, you find out you have triplets. They go up there and they can abort Take two of them the and save one. one. Yeah. yeah, like wow. it's like it's Captain Phillips, like sniping, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sniping yeah. three Ugandan yeah. guys at once. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's just a doctor with a uh, rifle pointed at your wife's <laughs> pussy. Yeah. Yeah. Click, click clicking yeah. in. It's the Chris Kyle floor of the clinic. <laughs> I'm the baby now. <laughs> uh, yeah, if you want to practice abortion, you get yourself a. Um, a papaya and like a turkey baster and you can like learn how to do it. Oh, because your wife has given abortions, right? Well, let's not go crazy. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah. This man still has to tour the South. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more worried about your fan base. <laughs> I don't want the members of Kekistan to come after her. Uh, she's going to wind up in a river somewhere. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, 
What? Wow. What? I'm saying she's being murdered. It's yeah. what I'm alluding to. Oh, yeah, that, that, that's, oh that's, sorry. What did yeah, you oh, think I said? Yeah, no, yeah. No, I just because she can't swim. So yeah, if, if she's dead in there. Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Jesus Christ. But, by by no. the way, do you get to choose which one the, uh, they abort? You it's do, the one with the biggest tits. <laughs> <laughs> the baby with the sweetest honkers. What, mm-hmm. keep. what if they're all boys? Uh, the one with the boobs? one with the biggest stick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, of course. It's, yeah, it's it's natural selection. Right. It's fine. I would I love you know because they're inventing CRISPR, the thing where you can like alter your baby's genes. Mm-hmm. I would love somebody to go in there in the future and like not they're just like just dick to max and change nothing else about my baby. <laughs> yes. yeah. Just that. Yes. Uh, I just want to see me with a gigantic. Yeah, hog. he slides it, for, it on the left. It says very micro penis, and on the far right, it says it fucking hurts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he slides it all the way down yeah. to the right. Yeah, too big to get all the way hard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. or it's yeah. actually like a detriment. To yeah, life. it yeah. Like, yeah. yeah ruins your life. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's like nice. Just slides into yeah. medical condition. Yeah. You're designing your baby with like an Xbox controller. Yeah. <laughs> like it's fucking Madden. Uh-huh. You're wearing a, a headset. Yeah, you hit a bong, and you're like, give him, make him. Ret- <laughs> Give him an only God can judge me tattoo on the right bicep, a sleeve. Damn, Devin, you're really funny. <laughs> like like the, everything you've said has been a slam dunk. Thank you, man. Yes. Mm. Hell yeah. Um, yeah, I don't yeah, know. This guy, though. Well, he just talks a lot. Yeah. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's drunk. Hey. She's been looking my uh, like calf for like two hours. Well, now. she probably had a big day of uh, being terrified yesterday. It was the Fourth of July. Yeah, and her birthday at oh, the same yeah, time. Fourth of July. Yeah. yeah. Yesterday I was at a party full of doctors with my wife, and uh, one of the dogs Ooh. was scared because of the uh, the fireworks. And I said to like three women over the guacamole bowl, I was like, "Today's the only day I'm glad my dog's dead." <laughs> Like, and you know, as you guys do, you laugh. Yeah. And they were just like, yeah. what do you mean? And then I got to do the great Why would bit. you say that? Yeah. And I was like, yeah, we, we put him down last year. And mm-hmm. they were like, oh, was he old? And I said, no, he was three. We're just kind of over it. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I doubled down. And I thought it would save it, you know? Right. Yeah. No, dude. I just had to, like, oh, yeah. all right. See you at the beer pong table <laughs> <laughs> with my peaked plate of guacamole. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You That's got for a, everybody. A handful of nacho cheese. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I just, yeah. I just have a ball cap full. <laughs> I'll tell you when I've had enough. Yeah, that was a big bomb. Well, I don't blame you, though. I assume everyone that's, like, about to get fucked up is can handle any type of dark joke, yeah. you know? If there's, like, a beer pong table, it's like, fucking laugh at my dead dog joke, I asshole. know, dude, but it's tough when you're... You go from, like, hanging out with comics and uh, mm-hmm. podcasters, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, please um, don't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> do not associate. There's a delineate. Well, you yeah. guys don't do stand-up anymore. Mm-hmm. But it's still funny people, I should have said. You mm-hmm. hang out with funny people, and then you go hang out with, you know, Bingus, Mingus, and Narco. <laughs> And uh, they got their cold, dead eyes because they haven't been butt fucked in a while. Sure. Yeah. yeah. You know, like you know how these fucking dizzy bitches are. Yeah. Sure. been spinning around too damn much. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, you know, you riff on your dead dog on the 4th of July and they're pissed. Any of those guys that become. Because du- I. I'm a very impressionable young man. And you do I, good impressions, yeah. Thank you. And I thought <laughs> that. Uh, I do a great Trump. I thought that. Uh, uh, I was like at one point when I was like seventeen or maybe fifteen. I was like, oh, I'm I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna become a doctor because I, I like the show House. Yeah, yeah. So what I started doing because I thought being a uh, this was being a doctor. I got I bought a cane at a drugstore and I started walking around with a limp for maybe five months. Mm-hmm. And people you, this told this is true. Yeah, it's very it's true. true. I went to school like this. Mm-hmm. And uh, I started. I think I talked like Doctor House for a while oh too. God, I just, think it was like sophomore year of high school. Asshole clips to everybody. Mm-hmm. Oh god. Acted like I was in a lot of pain with my knee and stuff. Like probably putting Tic Tacs in a pill bottle and yeah. then like, like yeah. taking them. school more like prison. <laughs> <laughs> and I get up. I just limp. <laughs> limp right. yeah. and I just play on the piano. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, it seems I, like you've got an acute tummy ache. <laughs> 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 I have uh, chronic ouchie syndrome. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I actually kind of, I think I still fucked up my hip from doing that for like six months. He fucked up his own hip from doing the show. Oh, he did? Yeah. Yeah. It started to hurt after a while. I was like, fuck, because I'm putting on my weight on like one leg. You being a method actor for nothing is very funny. (laughs) Yes. (laughs) Yeah. Uh, but I pretended to be, and I was like, I'll be a doctor because I have this, I have this cane. It's very cool. I mean, I was a very, you know, lost young man. Uh, sure. Yeah. Know, I'm still wandering. And the next year you yeah. were Patrice. The whole school's like, then, what is going on? So yeah, yeah, when I was 19, I had a Patrice phase for two months where I started wearing Celtics flat bills and I started going, <laughs> I mean, it's like, it's just the thing. I had no friends freshman year of college. And for like two months, I st- pretended I was Patrice. 
I like had a stool in my room. I would like sit on it when I watch TV. Mm-hmm. Like, I mean, it's it's yeah. it, it, it's the thing. Like, yeah, you should have pretended to be Bobo. <laughs> <laughs> and, and this was at SMU. Uh, it's similar, ACU. ACU, that's for Abilene Christian. Yeah, I had no friends for a full year. I didn't speak to a single human being. It's illegal so, to be black there, so they must have been pissed. Mm-hmm. It's illegal to be in an openly gay relationship there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, not illegal, but they uh, expel out. you yeah. if you're gay. Yeah. What if you're just secretly... Well, you, I'm sorry, you can then be you're the gay, you can't of the be in a gay relationship. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Still, hey, still got. Listen, I don't do stand up, but I can, I can hang. <laughs> I get it. Listen, I know about Boston in the eighties. I get stand up. <laughs> I hate trans kids. I get stand up. <laughs> we love crowd work here. Yeah, <laughs> love a good clip. Mm-hmm. Uh, yes, sir. Are you serious I, about being I, Patrice in college? Yeah, yeah, dude. It, fuck, I really man? sucked. Oh my god. Yeah, it really sucks, bad man. Yeah, I uh, I was I was fuck, dude. I was raised so hyper religious, yeah, and also, I had no idea what was going he on. He also had a Boston. I didn't know Celtics. how sex worked. I thought babies came out of the butt. No one gave me a sex talk. Well, I think Jace did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> it wasn't it wasn't a talk? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ben's, Ben's a hands on learner. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I I molested my brother. <laughs> is the is the joke of that? Yes! <laughs> Woo! We he fucked it. me in my holes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah. His favorite book. Yeah. This is this is like the the bitches yeah. brew of podcasting. Yeah, it's the joke. Like you just walk makes sense. You walk in, you're just like everybody do whatever the hell you want. Yeah. <laughs> just end on a G. <laughs> yeah, instead of abbreviating the one. Uh, oh Lord, Ben. I, what was even? What was also bad? Ben had a Boston flat brim and a Lakers flat brim, and he would wear them like on alternating depending days. on what color uh, Patrice jacket I was wearing Jesus yeah Christ. yeah <laughs> he gave himself diabetes too <laughs> <laughs> it was also nice of you to raise that old black woman's child <laughs> that, was, <laughs> that was my favorite mm-hmm. I uh yeah I had a I had a couple really bad phases like that I'm trying to think if I had it oh my question to you about doctors though did any of them become doctors just because they really liked Grey's Anatomy or like Scrubs? I mean, or to house? a T, they all they all did love Grey's Anatomy, and a large contingency of them loves Bones as well. Mm-hmm. Which one's that? Uh, it was uh, the Hot Deschanel. They're both pretty, but the one with like Ray, uh, a woman's body, Zoe Deschanel. Mm. No, the other one. The other one. Yeah. Oh, um, I thought Zoe was a cute young. She uh, is cute, but one has like an actual like like birth giving hips ooh, and like a sweet set, you know, nice like a drawing your brother used to do. Mm-hmm, exactly. You know? Yeah, yeah. Um, Not for public, just for my own. Right. Yeah, yeah. In your files. Yeah. Yes. I'm like in, in my house. I'm like Robert Crumb. Yeah. yeah. Uh huh. You oh, dude, you should save your your sketchbooks and trade them for a house in in France. Mm, well, did he do that shit? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Well, a whole yeah. like chateau. Oh. I mean, I don't. All the time? It's just it's nonstop, what? just like specifics. It's like, was the door wooden? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, crumb. What kind of bread was it? <laughs> was it pastry? Yeah. He thinks he thinks our crumb is retard crumb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Robert Crumb moved to France. Weird yeah. place for a guy that loved giant women. I know. Mm. Well, he was married at this point. Oh, okay. It was him and his lady they moved over there to raise their daughter in France. And then he recently finally came back to the States, like earlier, like last month. And he drove across the country uh, with his like nephew or something. Mm-hmm. It was his first time being back annoying in the whole way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. Just, Just sucking ass. Yep. <laughs> Just sucking ass. Dude, I remember yeah. watching. He really did. Yeah. He's being I a total dude. chode. Dude, yeah. I, I love his, his art. <laughs> Listening to him talk, I'm like, shut the fuck up, yeah. dude. You suck. He still like kind of talks like a hipster beatnik yeah. kind of guy. Dude, it's like or... watching like Bill Hicks like stand up. Yeah. I mean, I like it, but it's like, you know, there's a point to be 14 and a point to, sure. you know, mm-hmm. not. Yeah. He just you can't blame him. He's just he's just so horny that he can't he can't yeah. be a human being he's barely. Like clinically horny. Yeah. No. Yeah. yeah it should be a medical diagnosis <laughs> yeah. for how horny that guy yeah. is. Yeah, he should be killed like a dog with rabies. Yes. Like put down by a deputy. It's the only reason he's an artist at all. Is he's 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 so horny he has to get his ideas of women out on on the page so he can master I'm assuming he's just masturbating to these photos. Yeah. Yeah, probably in his chateau. His poor brother. 
<laughs> yeah, his poor brother all poor fucked brother. up. Had no, yeah. No, yeah, he had to go. He had to sneak into Robert's room and steal his drawings. The jack. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> poor guy. Yeah, poor fucking guy. Dude, that movie was fucked. I know yeah. it's so crazy. Yeah, my dad showed it to me as a kid because he was like, <laughs> "Why?" I literally saw it as a kid too for some fucked yeah. up reason. My dad, I think too. My first memory that I like, my first like actual memory is watching that part from Clockwork Orange where they prevent that rape on the theater mm. stage. Mm. My dad thought it was a cool fight scene and he wanted me to see it. <laughs> Wait, he was like, Sam, come in here. Yeah, he was like, I want to show you this. Yeah. yeah. And then the same thing with Crumb. He was like, you'll like this movie. He's a cartoonist. Because I used to draw. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's like Where I grew dad, out man. of it. Hey, you like pinball? Death Wish is on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> So, so none of them did be uh, people. People do openly admit they're like, yeah, I'm a huge Zach Braff fan. That's why I went to med, med school for nine years. <laughs> I am curious about that though, because that's how my mind works. I like, I literally will watch a movie where a guy, it's like, oh, he's a guy, you know, he kills people with a hammer, and like, also he loves cherry coke. And yeah. then for the next month, I'm like, I also love cherry coke. Yeah, I remember when you sure. saw Baby's Day Out and you crawled everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was yeah. crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. You know, they all do love. I mean, they all they. Uh, they always end up talking about Grey's Anatomy. Yeah, I I are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Wow. Yes. I, I have heard anec anecdotally that every like nurse is like basically like the the super mean chick in high school just becomes a nurse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And then they talk on speakerphone on the bus. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's crazy. On. They make like 120k a year and they still ride the. They bus. still ride yeah. the bus because <laughs> they're, they're like, all pilled up and drunk. Mm -hmm. Sean anywhere. Baker's there studying them for his next movie <laughs> yeah. about a trashy person. Yeah. All those firefighters banged him out so bad they can't drive. Yeah, yeah, it sucks. <laughs> yeah nurses yeah but apparently they were the girls like in high school where they're like you're fat you should kill yourself and then they're like you know your grandma lives or dies based on this person <laughs> yeah 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 this person who's like uh just going in the bathroom and then getting fucked according to like every porn website i've ever been on yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> a girl who has the, the graffiti s yeah. on her, on her <laughs> arm <laughs> <laughs> yeah, girls who were into shine down. They yeah. Yeah. Nurses. I met the uh, the janitor from Scrubs oh, once yeah? in real life. He's no, like, he's like very depressed and like absolutely. I'm 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 gonna actually Google him right now see if he's killed himself. I met Mark Schlereth at the airport today. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah I saw Schlereth? that on Instagram. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 stinky. Yeah, stink. Who? Oh, one of the little rascals. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It was. Yep. Yes. <laughs> I can barely contain myself. I'm so excited that he thought that. So yeah. anyone else, sorry. take the reins right now. Uh, yes. Attack me, yeah. Sam. <laughs> no. <Charge. laughs> no, he was an offensive lineman for the Denver Broncos during their Super Bowl years. So, oh. Uh, yeah, and I have his jersey, and I, I've worn it He used it to a piss lot. on himself, right? He'd piss, he would shit, he'd yeah. throw up. <laughs> he was a really good analyst, too. Yeah, yeah. I miss him on TV. I think he's on Fox this year because he had like a Fox NFL tag on his back. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Good. He was very nice. And I, I shook his hand and I said, I handsome, wear your jersey. Handsome man. Beautiful, brilliant teeth. Yeah. Really? Insane teeth. You really? think they're yeah. the, the fakes, the veneers? They could be. Yeah. If they're fake, guess what? I don't want to be real. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's getting those things now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I just love those linemen who are they like, they were like really fat in the NFL. And then one year into retirement, they're like the most handsome person I'm you've so ever seen. about it. He I was know. Cut. He was wearing like a large t-shirt today. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I'm like dragging my bag, sweating, you know? <laughs> Right, as a big guy, you're like, you stole two things I always wanted. Yes. An uh -huh. NFL career and yeah. being hot. Having forearms. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And he, I was like, thank you. And he was like, what? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> For what? <laughs> like, I'm a Broncos right. fan. Thank, thank you, sir. Yeah, Schlereth, old stink. Number 69. Wow. Oh, hell that? yeah. Before it was like. A thing. Yeah. yeah. Before they made that connection. For uh, some, I wonder who thought that up at the beginning. Probably uh, a caveman and a chimp. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, probably. Yeah. Oh, oh, you mean like actually have been at 69? Yeah. I'm sure someone uh, was, uh, you know, walking through the, so the Stone Age world, you know, playing the flute on some vulture bone, and then they looked up and they saw like two dogs <laughs> sucking each other off at the same time. Yeah. Sure. And like a light bulb went off over their head, and then. I do know a guy. Uh, I forget his name. He was like a I cop. <laughs> the way you were staring at me. What? 
There's no other way to stare at you. <laughs> yeah. I should be looking at you through a piece of green bottle glass, <laughs> like an eclipse. Right. We should be looking at you in a in a jar. We keep you in. Yeah. Yeah. Where, you, yeah. <laughs> where you where you have your little boat, <laughs> like in a science experiment, mm-hmm. and we shake you around, yeah. Yeah. like throw you against T- the glass, tap on the glass, tap on it. Looking at you through a people at the end of Paris, Texas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then still doing the sexy dances. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you see, that's your son. He goes, actually, I don't want to meet him anymore. <laughs> mm. Yeah, shit. Fuck, I forgot what I was gonna say. No, it's okay. I don't know. I'm gonna, Sam, can you hear me that gun? I'm gonna bottle. kill all of us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right, it's what I do best. Everybody, get in. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use one bullet. Everybody, uh, you ever see the house that Jack built? I'm gonna do that thing at the end. You should curve it like Wanted. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Remember that movie where they curve the bullet? Oh, where Angelina Jolie yeah. had those really sexy back tattoos of like, uh, yes, of uh, tattoos. Was, yeah. Of exactly. Chinese letters and stuff. Mm-hmm. Tattoos of tattoos. I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, she had like a flash page. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and it said $30. Yep. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She had a tattoo that just said a bunch of Chinese letters. Dude, yeah. yeah. I miss Mythbusters because at the time Mythbusters was like, we're going to do an episode today because this everybody's been wondering, can you actually curve a bullet around a house? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And can you hide in, in water from a bullet? They did that episode. Which is oh, it's of, really interesting because yeah. you, you can't. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It just, the bullet breaks up like immediately. Yeah. It does? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh-uh. So every movie you've seen where it's like, choo, 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 like it, it's not true. Don't those guys yeah. hate each other? The Mythbusters guys? The yeah, they don't. Wrong. Yeah. One of them uh, died suddenly. It was very tragic. The Here Chinese guy. The Asian actually, one. Oh, yeah. He looked into that. He was faking it. Myth busted. <laughs> 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 yeah. He was just asleep and he smelled funny. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> he, yeah he faked his death with the dummy they used on the show. Yeah. yeah. Imagine with the having that dummy. <laughs> When Ooh, you were 15, fuck it all day long. God, I'd be busting more than myths. You know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying boys? Yeah. Huh? A slow mo of your jizz going through the ballistic doll's head. Yes. yes. Yeah. That would be nuts. Then a guy with a beret coming over and like, whoa, the dimensions were. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> he had yeah. zinc today. Yeah. The thing about the dick hole, the meat is, is it, it makes it spin as it comes out like an NFL spiral. Yes. Yeah. They yeah. should just bust porn myths. That's how they should bring the show back. Yeah, monsters of cock. Is yeah. all the cum real? Right. <laughs> yeah, they're like, it's actually a camera angle. You know, most cocks in porn are seven to eight inches. <laughs> Do they really throw them out of the bus? <laughs> <laughs> or is that for effect? They weren't stuck at all. <laughs> no one's related. Right. <laughs> Dude, bang bros. Oh, the best Yikes. when I was a kid. Mm. Unbelievable. Yeah, yeah Devin was website. a huge Bang Bros. People he was a fucking, huge fan. We were slinging the passwords <laughs> around like it was like weed back in middle How school. How about this? Let's do this. Favorite porn star. We'll go. We'll be specific. Favorite Bang Bros porn star on three. Oh, okay. Uh, well, ready? You got one? Uh, yeah. Okay. On three. One, two, three. Gianna Asa Michaels. Also Akira. Okay, yeah. good one as Yours well. Yours is Gianna Michaels? Of course. That was, was what I was going to say, too. Oh, my God. Love dude. Gianna Michaels. I changed dude. it last minute. Dude. I was going to say her tone. Yeah. She's the legend. She was yeah. the best. She's yeah. just, she's got spunk. She's got spunk. You know? yeah, she wanted a, it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> such a great laugh. Right. Oh, I know. She, she was, was like, having fun in there. She's she was having like a lot of fun. The one porn star where you were like, I think she's like raping them. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like she turned the table. So yeah. yeah. It was great. Yeah. God, she was special. There's that one video. I know we've all seen it. One video where she's like just sucking off like 80 Mexican dudes oh, in yeah. the house, yep. and one guy, one guy is like in the back. He's wearing like a bandana and a leather jacket. And he, he's like fucking with her, and he's like fucking whore, bitch. Like fuck you. And then she's like going back at him, and then at the end, she makes a guy come, and then she just spits it on yes. him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yes. the whole like all the cholos are like going like fucking insane, yeah. and he like he like walks out of the house. It's great. That's awesome. Covering yeah. some good dude's load. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, man. Uh, I'm going to close the show. Yeah, go oh, for okay, it. Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, we've done like an hour and a half. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Listen to my podcast, Chubby, Chubby Behemoth. Behemoth. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. We're uh, very similar to this. People compare us often. Yeah, people uh, People come up to you. They say, we love Lemon Party and we love Chubby Behemoth. Guys. Right. That's what they say. Like, I mean, my name's Jace, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, in all sincerity, Ben, I love you. I've loved you for a long time, and I, I'm so glad we're friends, but I'm just so happy for you guys. It's oh, great. thank you. Thank you, you Sam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I appreciate yeah. that, man. Yeah, I was yeah, glad yeah. And I am. Great. I know I, I did a lot of jokes. I read your book much before, Ben, yeah. and I. it yeah. was so good, it made me pissed off at you. Thanks, Ben. Yeah. And I messaged you, fuck you, yeah. because mm-hmm. the book was so the good. Highest compliment. You're talent is to be envied. Thanks, yeah. man. Yeah. Like from, Sam, from, from a great creative, yeah. it's very nice to receive. More like Sam multi-talent. 
Well, Thank you. Very yeah. good. Sam hyphen it. Yeah. Wish it was Sam Hyman, but my uncle took care of that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cool. I had a pussy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And it yeah. Carved yeah. Ruined it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then patreon.com slash lemon party. Go join the, the, the peop- good folks over there. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's a little... Uh, like 4,500 people over there. So huge, people, dude. people are having fun. They're it's having a huge. good time. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, it's, 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 uh, it's like the, it harkens back to the days of like, you know, girls gone wild type yeah. of stuff where you, you want to see what's behind those black bars. Yeah. You want to see those tits. Oh, right. yep. You want to see those nipples, you mm-hmm. know? Right. So you're going to stay up late and you're going to, you're going to join the Patreon. Yeah. Go, go over time. there and let them show yeah. you, show you where babies feed. Yeah. You want to see the behind the scenes of the American apparel photo shoot. <laughs> what really oh, was yeah. going on? Like a Larry right. Clark there. deleted <laughs> scene. <laughs> we do movies on here. <laughs> Patreon.com. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> and then uh, also, uh, Sam is on tour. So go see uh, SamTallon.com for yeah. his tour Australia, and stuff. Australia, come out. Uh, Boston, everywhere. SamTalent.com. All right. Thanks. Thank you, everybody. Bye. And we'll Bye. see you next week. Bye-bye.